I'm Julie Pace with the AP Race Rundown. We're just a few days away from the Indiana and North Carolina primaries. Now obviously we're going to be watching those primaries closely and of course the votes do count. But it's time to face facts. This Democratic primary is really coming down to superdelegates. Here's why I say this. We have about 500 pledged delegates still out there in the upcoming primaries. If this race follows the pattern that we've been seeing, Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton will likely split those pledged delegates, leaving neither of them with a claim on the Democratic nomination. At that point, the race will be in the hands of the superdelegates. It's pretty interesting to watch the way the superdelegates have split at this point. Most of the superdelegates who committed early sided with Hillary Clinton, giving her a really large lead in the superdelegate tally. But Obama has actually cut that lead to about 20. We've seen a lot of the superdelegates who have come out recently siding with him. But still, there are about 300 uncommitted superdelegates. Both campaigns are fighting hard for those. Barack Obama will be making a pretty direct appeal to the uncommitted superdelegates this weekend. He'll be appearing on Meet the Press for a full hour. Now, Meet the Press is the big popular Sunday talk show. People across the country tune into it, but the people who really watch closely are Washington insiders, people like the superdelegates. You can bet they'll all be hanging on to Barack Obama's every word this weekend as he answers the inevitable questions about Reverend Wright or his opposition to the gas tax holiday. Now, Hillary Clinton's main argument to the superdelegates is all about electability. Her campaign is making sure that the superdelegates see some of these polls that are coming out, including one from the AP and Ipsos, that suggest that Clinton may have a better chance of beating John McCain than Obama does. Now, beyond the issue of who the superdelegates will support, the big question is when will they commit? DNC Chair Howard Dean wants the superdelegates to come out by early June so the party can avoid a convention fight come August. I'm Julie Pace with the AP Race Rundown.